Samurai Finn, if we aren't looking to draft Addison with our first pick for the upside, mm-hmm. would it make sense to trade back since there are several positions to address? I mean, the trade back element is always on the table when you're talking about just acquiring more draft capital. But if you could somehow get an additional second yeah, in a trade back. Yeah. I just think it's one of those things that we just I always want to remind us. More picks, yes. But the later you move back, the player. Pros and cons are just slightly different. When you're talking first round, usually you just feel a lot more confident in the player that you're getting. You're more confident in the return on the investment. Whereas when you start talking second round, it's not always a guarantee. Or the chances of it producing the way that we anticipate it, it just goes down a little bit. And, it, you know, the later you go in this thing, the lower and lower and lower those odds get. So we just got to take that into account. If we're bringing in guys and we're asking them to be starters for us, how fast are we looking for them to take on that role? If you're bringing them in the first round, he's more than likely going to be up to speed enough that he can come in here and be our day one type of guy. When you start bringing in seconds and third rounders, it's not always a guarantee that each and every one of them are going to be able to come in here, be pro ready and give us not just starter minutes, but starter level productivity. So that's the only thing that when we talk trading back, it always makes me just a little leery when we're talking about trying to bring in starters, because when we're talking our cornerback position, the guy that we drafted more than likely is going to be a starter for us. When we're looking at the D-line, depending on what we do with Larry and Cam Hayward, that guy could be a starter for us. We not. I know TG said they're going to move on from uh, from, from Deontay. You kind of hinted at it as well. But if that is the case, once again. Only for a first rounder. I don't think yeah. we're getting a first rounder. For <laughs> okay. Because I was going to say, if we move on from Deontay. I don't think we're getting a first Once again, rounder. it's like, no man, way. like you just playing with fire, even though you have more picks. And it does feel good this time of year. But. How many times do we talk our draft class and we go through and we say, yeah, this guy's playing well, but is he, if he would have been the day one starter and we're relying on him to be the starter and productive like that, would it play out the same way? So that's the only thing, like I said, just to be cautious a little bit about. I could only see it being worth it if we're able to trade back, get the early second or a late first in the swap, yeah. but then also get a second round pick. Like, in addition, yeah. I don't know if you that's to, what that, that the value like a robbery, is. Bro. That's what I mean. Yeah, I don't know that if like that's a what a, a value is to trade back into the first or trade up in the first at that spot. Yeah, I don't know. Don't know what the market is really, but that's the only way it would make sense to me. Yeah. If we still are able to keep mm-hmm. that pick that we swap somewhere in yeah. the late first or early second, but then we also get an additional like second yeah. rounder. Because I would, would not want to move on from Deontay and now I'm replacing him with you know second third round type and we're talking yeah man we're gonna pair this rookie with calvin austin who hasn't played in a year and we're gonna say george pickens all right cool that's gonna be the like well that's well that's not even talking about trading deontay that's just trading back in the draft that's that's another team saying oh i I want this guy at 17 got you got you okay i don't think he's gonna fall anymore i want to try to get ahead of another team so that's just us maybe trading back to like 30 yeah and then do they give us for that swap do they give us a second round pick got you like just yeah depending on where they're coming from that's How what I'm saying. Back, I, I don't know exactly what the market yeah. is for those type of trades, but that's where it would make sense to me. Can we yeah. still pick late in the first round, yeah. but then we get an additional second? Yeah, that, that would, would be, be like that five would be picks in the top yeah. fifty or something. That would like be that. dope. 